Yeah, I mean, the teams worked uh, very hard to to make a, a very accurate depiction of sort of uh, eight or nine boroughs in, in central London. Um, we try to capture uh, the city from, you know, Camden Market in the north to Windrush Square in the south and from uh, Buckingham Palace Gardens in, in the east all the way over to, um, to the Limehouse Basin in the, in the east. Buckingham in the west, sorry. <laughs> Um, you know, Watch Dogs has always been about, you know, holding people in power accountable and, and you know, Watch Dogs Legion is no different. We looked at different, you know, um, social themes and economic themes and technological themes uh, in, in London and, uh, and you know, focused the story around, um, around uh, you know, how, how those in power and, and our sort of fictional rising authoritarian enemies have, have corrupted the state and, and threatened our democracies with their abuse of that power. <laughs> I mean, there, there, are the, there are theoretically an infinite number of characters. Um, you know, we, we, the game uh, and its play as any one innovation means that, you know, every character has their own home and friends and family and job and relationships and problems. And characters are kind of uprezzed uh, uh, on demand uh, in order to uh, in order to meet the expectations that you have when you see them walking down the street. Yeah, every single person that gets uh, generated and uprezzed has their own name, their friends, their family, their job, their home. They have, you know, a history and a backstory that defines their abilities. Maybe someone, you know, used to be in the military and so they have weapons training or maybe someone is a, is a you know, a, a, a minor celebrity and they have a very expensive car or something like that. So uh, how a person is generated determines what their abilities are and, and what they can do with it. <laughs> Um, I, I'm a big fan of the recently, you know, I play the game a lot, so I get to play different characters all the time. And recently I've been a big fan of some of the drone expert type characters. They have tend to have their own drone. They have special abilities they can do with the drones. They can uh, hijack enemy drones and cause them to turn against their opponents. So there's lots of cool uh, strategies and tactics you can use with, with that, those, those types of abilities. Um, you know, Watch Dogs Legion is really one of our core design pillars is that you should be able to play the game however you want. So if you want to be a sweet old lady uh, who carries a revolver, you can be that. Or if you want to be a, you know, a sneaky guy or a, someone who fights with his fists or whatever. So however you want to play, really, you can, you know, be who you want to be, but also play the way you want to play. I tend to prefer to play kind of stealthy and using melee to kind of uh, avoid the enemies and, and encounter as few as possible.